Hey, and welcome back. I know that you've been wanting to see an update for a while now on how my giant sequoia are growing. I made the mistake originally of planting them with uh, box guards, tube guards, uh, but the trouble was it just constricted them too much. Look at this. They like to branch out, but they still need protection from deer and other wildlife. Otherwise, your poor little tree, poor little sequoia can get eaten very quickly. So these are now all upgraded to their uh, cage guards. So two years ago, I tried growing sequoia with uh, bare roots. So you spread the seeds onto a finely prepared soil bed, cover them with sand, keep them nice and damp. And yes, they did germinate and they did actually grow quite strongly. But last year we had a very damp year and unfortunately most of them died with um, damping off. So the foliage just wilted, um, they didn't do very well. But one thing I did notice, and I'll show you a picture of now, is that when I dug one up, the roots were very long and they'd gone straight down. Aftercare is a huge thing, which is why I'm here today watering these. And if you want your giant sequoia to do well, I would suggest guards, mulch, wood chip is your friend. Because if I was to dig down here, you'll see the ground is cooler underneath, it's damper. And that works in the summer when it's very hot, but also in the winter. It keeps the ground temperature regulated keeps the moisture in and the sun off of the soil and it lets all the little microbes and fungus work under there in harmony with the tree which will prosper. is to do them in the bag method as usual but when they've germinated to prick them out and put them into root trainers and these are the maxi root trainers. November 2024 there are eight here currently I'm so pleased to see the growth on some of these trees this one right here number four it's got probably best part of two foot growth this year just look at it the others doing really well the uh, couple we planted earlier this year they're pushing on through and the exciting thing is, at home I've got 10 more to join their ranks this winter, which I'll be planting out soon. It's lovely to see. batch of seed is a big one weighing seven grams direct from the motherland of California and promising 51% germination. Check back in future years for updates. Every year I want to take a little video diary of how these guys are doing and how their new family, extended family is coming along. Um, so watch the space. Thanks for watching.